using kmap method obtain minimal sop expression and implement the function using nand gates this is the given function we supposed to simplify this using kmap and we have to implement this using nand gates so here it is five variable function as here we have five variables a b c d e so as we know in five variable k maps we supposed to use two four variable k maps two four variable k maps so in that i will use b c d e as variables for each four variable k map and variable a i will use for a equal to 0 for one k map and a equal to 1 for another k map that is here i have drawn two k maps this k map is for a equal to 0 and this k map for a equal to 1 because in five variable k map we must use two four variable k maps like this so here the remaining variables are bc and de so now let me enter the values so here these are the decimal numbers indicates in these cell numbers we supposed to write 1 so that is 1 3 4 6 let me write 1 3 4 6 then we have 9 11 12 14 that is 9 11 12 14 then we have 17, 19, 20, 22, 17, 19, 20, 22, we have 20, 22, then 25, 27, 25, 27, 28, 30, that is 28, 30. So now we'll try to simplify this. So here we can observe that this 1, 1 and this 1, 1 are adjacent to each other. Similarly, here this 1, 1 and this 1, 1 are adjacent to each other. So we can consider these 1, 1, this 1, 1, this 1, 1, this 1, 1 are adjacent to each other. So I can write it as this 1 and this 1. Similarly, this, this 1 and this one so with respect to this the expression here it is so here if you consider these two columns the common factor is e that is e and with respect to these two rows the common factor is c bar that is c bar so here a equal to zero it means it is a bar c bar e so this also we have to consider so with respect to this i can write plus with respect to this it is a and here also it will be same row and same column because these two are corresponding to each other therefore this will be a c bar e so simplifying this we know that c bar e is common here i can write c bar e is common here a plus a bar that is a bar plus a which is equal to one therefore it is c bar e so if we do the grouping in both the k maps then we no need to consider this variable a because anyhow its value will become one as we can see here so directly we can write it as c bar e that is here the common term and we have to find row wise common term and we have to write the expression so this is c bar e so next we have this one one this one one and this one one similarly here also this one one this one one are adjacent to each other so this 4 12 are adjacent to 20 and 18 6 14 are adjacent to 22 and 30 similarly 4 12 is adjacent to even 6 14 20 28 is adjacent to 22 30 so together i can take a single expression this is this one and this one here this one and this one so together i can write it as between these two column the common factor is 0 0 1 0 that is 0 0 is corresponds to e that is e bar so here also we'll get the same thing that is e bar itself 
so with respect to these two row or these two row both are same so here the common term is c that is c e bar so therefore the final expression is f equal to v of c bar e c bar e plus v of c e bar c e bar so this is nothing but x or gate that is c x or e so this is the simplified expression so now we'll try to implement this using nand gates let me rewrite the expression that is f is equal to v of c x or e that is c x or e which is nothing but v of c bar e plus c e bar that is c bar e plus c e bar so we'll try to implement this using nand gate so i will explain you how to implement using nand gate first write the expression so this is the expression that is f equal to v of c bar e plus c e bar take complement on both side so i can take complement on both side f bar is equal to v of c bar e plus c e bar complement or i can simplify this as i will apply de morgan's theorem here that is c bar e complement dot v of c e bar complement so here we have f bar so i can write again i will take complement on both side so that i can get f here so f is equal to c bar e complement dot c e bar complement and one more complement so this is the reduced expression now with the help of this expression we can draw the circuit using nand gate so here first let me consider c bar so let me draw c bar using nand gate so i should use one nand gate the input here is c here the output is c bar we have c bar e complement so let me take one more nand gate so here the input is c bar another input is e that is e here the output is c bar e complement so this part is done that is this part is done now now similarly we will try to implement this here e bar let me take one more nand gate both inputs are shorted input is e that is e output here is e bar no so now let me use one more nand gate here the input is e bar another input is c that is i can draw from here or i can write it as c the output here is c e bar bar now for this complement we have to use one more nand gate where output of this is connected to here and output of this is connected to here so output of this is nothing but f so thus we have implement implemented this using nand gates so here we have used five nand gates there is one more standard circuit for xor gate using nand gate where we can use only four nand gates i will draw that so this c x or e can also be implemented using four nand gates as so let me use one nand gate like this one nand gate here one nand gate here and one nand gate here so output of this is connected to here output of this is connected to here its output is connected here this output is connected here and here we have c and e this is c input this is e input this is connected to here also this e is connected here so the output of this will be c x or e so here both the circuits are same thank you for watching